cloth back in 1815 when it was first invented by Levi Palmery was made of silk and unwaxed. Now we make it of a uh, man-made fiber, which is nylon, because silk is, is very expensive now, so um, it's more inexpensive to use the nylon. And there's many forms of it. There's the unwaxed, there's the wax, there's the woven with the fluoride mixture, and you use the woven with the fluoride mixture. You use that for your posterior teeth to get food impaction out. Use the uh, um, wax for people that have tighter contacts um, so you can get in between the teeth a lot better. Um, so it's basically a personal preference what kind of floss you use today. Um, usually it's recommended by your dental hygienist or your, do or your dentist at the time whether they want you to use um, the waxed or non-waxed or even the woven depending on what um, your needs are at that time or what your personal preference are. You can always tell your hygienist, oh I'd rather use the wax versus the unwaxed or the woven. But it, it's something that is good to use every single night to help clean in between your teeth to reduce decay.